Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's the Amazing Brand, and today I'm going to be ranking all the Chapter 2 Season 2 Battle Pass skins. And yes, yesterday I finally made in Chapter 2, and I have to say this Battle Pass is way better than the last one. I'll just say that. Anyways, let's get into the video. And so, the only Battle Pass skin I think is bad from this season, at number 8, we have Agent Peely. He's not a very great skin, in my opinion. I do not like him at all. Maybe it's because the reason it's reskin. Although, you know what? I don't hate him. It's just a better Peely. And they made Peely better with this. And there's no disagreeing. But, yeah. Agent Peely, he's okay. You know, I wouldn't use him, but I think the top seven I will use, I would use almost every day. Anyways, actually, at number 7, we have Deadpool. The secret skin of the season ain't so secret for the first time. Then we had this with Aquaman and Wolverine, which are the next two videos I'm going to be doing. And, you know what? I just did not like... For this one season, I was like, fine, okay, it's cool. But then when they continued it with Aquaman, I'm like, please not be next season. Then they did it with Wolverine. Thank gosh, they stopped with Predator. The Predator is probably worse than all of them. Spoiler alert. But, yeah. Deadpool at number seven. At number six, we have the man, Chunky himself, Brutus. I will only use Shadow and Gold for the sky. Ghost I did not get, and I'm very happy. Because Ghost, as you can see in the right here, is nothing compared to this. I have to say, though, Gold and Shadow both look amazing. But Normal's definitely worse than Ghost. Ew, Normal's disgusting. Anyways, now, at number five, we have the first ever custom skin in Fortnite, your specialist Maya. Maya is brilliant. And now, you might be like, well, we have superheroes, blah, blah, blah. It was actually very, very, very smart at Epic Games to only do one choice and to, and like, to, you can't go back. Because I feel like that emphasized people to try to think about it more and it would get them more interested in Fortnite. It would make them be like, hmm, what should I do? And then when you finally make the skin, which I think mine's awful, here's mine. When you finally make the skin and you it, let's say you really like it, you're like, oh I really want to wear this with my favorite back bling. It's what I made it for. Blah blah blah. But you understand my point, I think, hopefully. But yeah. Maya I would say is probably so definitely smarter than the superheroes. Superheroes are amazing, but Maya had more, like, thinking. Put, I feel like they put more thought into Maya because they were like, okay, so this is probably going to cause an effect for people to grind to get the next challenge. I have that in my pocket. And, um, yeah. Maya, like, they wanted people to grind for her because, you know, that's more people playing their game. Anyways, then, at number four, this is where we get into some of my favorite skins of all time. Maya's good and all, but this is where we get into the nine, eight, nine, tens. So, at number four, we have T and Tina. Of the three skins above this, I use this one the least. I got Ghost for this skin. And, I don't know, I think I might regret it. I, I don't know. Ghost has this unique color scheme, so I don't think I'd regret Ghost. But I do regret one other th one thing like later down the line. But T and Tina, I would say Ghost is better. But I would say that her glider is probably yeah is the first rideable one, and yeah, I would just use T and Tina less than the next three skins. And at number three, we have the Buffy Man. Now not Brutus. Let's think of that Brutus in the next level. We have Meowsles. A kitty 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 is playing through my head. The I'm a kitty 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 song. Jeez, nostalgia of hearing that every game you play. Like if you got killed, kitty kitty kitty. If you killed someone, kitty kitty kitty. If they didn't even play Fortnite, it was their first game, they didn't even get the battle pass in your head. When they kill you, they're like, I'm a kitty kitty kitty. Yeah. And even when you get a win. That emo almost destroyed my head. But Meowsles itself, I chose Shadow. 
and Shadow is far superior to Ghost. This is the biggest difference. No, more than Brutus. Huge difference. Ghost, to me, is one of the worst skins in the game. Look. Well, that's just my opinion. You might have been like one of my friends. I chose all Ghost. Which you'll see. I already chose a Ghost and then two Shadows so far. Well, at number two, we have another Shadow. We have Midas. This is an amazing skin. And I have to say, this is probably... Not spoiling anything. So, yeah. But this is an amazing skin. And not the space style. You see, the ghost is okay. The shadow and bully gold are brilliant. This skin, top notch. And I chose shadow for it, by the way, if you didn't hear already. But at number one, we have my favorite skin from this battle pass. Not by a mile, but I use her definitely the most. It's a her, yes. And her name is Sky. Now, this is probably the worst style you're seeing on screen. Actually, gold is worse. Because you got fully gold for this battle pass. I forgot to mention that. But gold is probably the worst in this style. Then Ghost and Shadow. They are, if I could just get both, I would trade Shadow Measles, Shadow Midas, Ghost Tantina, maybe not Shadow Brutus. Yeah, I guess Shadow Brutus because I have gold. All... We're just getting Ghost Sky. Because I regret that choice. Not by a lot. Just by a little. I wish I could have both. Shadow is amazing. That's what I got. But Ghost and Shadow are both amazing for the skin. Top notch. In all ways. Except you need Epic Games. P.S. I did edit style with the hat off. It would make competitive people like the skin. And make the skin a lot more popular. Although I like Ollie a lot. Anyways, that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I guess I'll see you guys next time.